Hello all, this is Dr. Shilpi Reddy and this month and last couple of months were a very bad season for cold and cough. Yes, the weather is changing from spring to summer, the scratching heat but then there is a revival of lot of upper respiratory tract infections and everybody is falling prey to it. Today I wanted to talk about home remedies for cold cough especially the milder forms of cold cough which actually can be managed well with a lot of home care. I still remember my grandma giving me uh, two spoons of honey with glass of hot water uh, as a remedy for cold and cough. Similarly there are several home remedies that can actually help cold and cough and treat the symptoms as well give a lot of relief. Now when it comes to cold cough mostly it is viral infection. It does not need antibiotics. It needs symptomatic therapy for any allergy, anti-allergy, any decongestant medication for a lot of congestion. But home remedies do work very well. Especially age-old uh, remedy is taking honey with warm water. Honey has a role in increasing the immunity levels and as a decongestion agent. And anything warm taken will definitely give you a lot of relief. You can take warm soups, you can take rasam, the homemade rasam with pepper and lot of spices can also give me a lot of, uh, you know, a lot of decongestion in the respiratory tract. And similarly, anything warm eaten also makes a lot of difference for the jam packed nasal uh, airways and the throat, irritating throat. And whenever you use a little bit liberal amounts of ginger, whether it is ginger tea uh, or whether ginger in your cooking or whether it's ginger in your rasam or soups, it also makes a lot of difference in relieving congestion and treating the airway problems. Increased in, uh, intake of liquids, warm clear liquids and warm water can also make a lot of difference in cold and cough. So, uh, you know, treating dehydration and lot of hydration can itself be a cure, especially when there is a lot of mucus formation. Good amount of steam inhalation, whether the steam, uh, you know, you take it with menthol or any, you know, carbol caps kind of a thing or, uh, you know, the homemade uh, steam with some herbs or with some neem leaves or anything. You know, steam per se will relieve the nasal and uh, uh, nasopharyngeal passages and it will clear the mucus and it will give a lot of relief. Especially flushing of mucus is very, very important. For children and for adults who uh, you know are suffocated with a lot of stuffed nose and mucus, you can use nasal drops or you can use uh, either the native pot kind of uh, you know flushing of mucus with a saline or with normal water itself. And uh, you know the common menthol that is available in so many products uh, over the counter can give you relief when it is rubbed on the chest and taken uh, you know the, if you take breath with menthol and menthol also has a decongestant effect and it's a natural remedy for congested nose and pharynges and uh, you know if there is a lot of stuffiness in the throat also warm water gargle with salt the best thing is salt water gargle to do and if you can add some betadine or anything that, that will, will prevent uh, the bacterial growth or the viral uh, growth it is beneficial so normal saline water uh, warm water saline uh, gargle can also help a lot whenever you have stuffy throat and throat pain also and for children and adults who have this dryness everywhere humidifier also makes a lot of difference and as Indians we know we have our nuska and uh, uh, there are so many things on daily basis that your grandparents and parents give you uh, the Indian herbs are very very important uh, in terms of giving you decongestion, the mint leaves and uh, the concoction made with ginger, lime and the concoction made with uh, you know coriander, uh, curry leaves, all these things and the spices like cloves, cinnamon, uh, you know cardamom, uh, star anise, all these herbs definitely have an impact on relieving the nasal congestion especially pepper you know Indian pepper is known for decongestion effect and it clears the airways and uh, you can make uh, homemade cough drops with ginger honey and uh, some uh, you know sugar and make them into a, into a drop kind of a consistency and have them to relieve the 
nasal as well as uh, oral and nasopharyngeal congestion. So these are little bit of home remedies that can actually benefit in cold and cough. But if the cold cough is increasing and it is the symptomatic medications are not working, you should rush to the hospital because it can be COVID and COVID is coming back and uh, you should be vigilant on that. Any amount of fever, you should not neglect, reach out to the physician. It, these tips work for milder forms of problem and only, uh, you know, these are traditional forms of uh, handling milder disease. And whenever you have severe form, definitely reach out to the hospital and that is very, very important. If you like my videos, do share and subscribe. Thank you.